Hey, 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 what's going on? What's up, everybody? Welcome to our channel, Tea Girl Magic Tarot. Here to do a reading for my J -J Gemini, my Gemini's. What is happening, my beautiful babies? Welcome, 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 new people, cross watchers, new subscribers, everyone. You guys, we're growing, healing, and evolving together. You know what? We're our family's getting bigger, so that's why I might repeat myself <laughs> through a lot of the videos until I probably get up to <laughs> forever. Okay. Um, new people. We sing on this channel, I'm just telling you right now, and if you don't like it, then bye-bye. Or either fast forward through the singing, please don't leave comments of, oh, the singing is killing me. <laughs> but you're such a wonderful reader. Look, I don't give a damn what the singing does for you, okay? The singing is not for you if you're low vibe. Clearly you are if you are making those comments in my comment section, okay? You're coming to someone's home, telling them what you don't like about their house and they don't give a damn then leave okay leave me out and i do cuss on this channel so if you're uh sensitive and shit like that then this is not the channel for you either okay so yeah jim and i love you guys high vibe cross watchers everybody i love you thank you for all your love and your support and with all of that wonderful being things being said let's begin one, two, three, oh, tea girl, tea girl, magic and collective. Tea girl, tea girl, tea girl, magic and collective. Tea girl, tea girl, magic and collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Ow. Uh, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Yay, choir, a round of applause. Hallelujah, hallelujah. And we sing because we raise the vibrations. Music is the most wonderful, highest vibration and frequency of all, especially when you involve love in that. This Gemini song, because Geminis are lovers, it is infused with love. And it is, it is excuse me, it's a song directly from Divine himself through me to you, Gemini, okay? So low vibers, then, then, then this is not for you if you don't like it, okay? You're telling on yourself, you're telling who you are, and you need to heal. But there is hope for you, because you're here. Welcome. We hope you stay, but if you don't, that's okay. Namaste. Anyway, and have a great day. Um, The Holy Spirit is sending masters of the highest white light, pure love. Only what is going on in Gemini's energy? Now, keep in mind, you guys, this is a general message, and the message is made, or they may not resonate with anybody, okay? So just take the messages that resonate. And leave the rest <laughs> yes gemini finding balance okay uh oh gemini you know what this is by the time you read this because i'm recording this on thursday for friday i think but we're in a full moon okay so a lot of you guys are actually using this this you know what some of you are anxious and that's okay you guys gonna have to work through that and raise those vibrations but i know this particular moon cycle for myself amazing amazing i don't uh, honey i am such in a wonderful state of mind and peace and exist of existence like i feel like i found balance okay so a lot of you guys are finding balance though so find the balance between your work rest and playtime, and you will have more energy harmony and productivity in your life take a power nap yeah so some of you guys are Running a little, little weary, sleepy, tired. You got a lot on your plate. You're taking care of the kids. Some of y'all going to school and taking care of the kids as single parents. Okay, even if you're not a single parent, you're full-time. You have a spouse, okay, that you guys, you know, got to deal with them and the kids or whatever. But anyway, I'm just feeling right now in this new moon, I mean, sorry, this full moon cycle, a lot of you are actually have found your balance, okay? You have found your balance to receive these magical blessings on this new moon because this is fruition when the, when your your wishes are taking place and some of you 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 almost there you got to just find kind of find some balance cuz like I said before you're feeling imbalanced because you know the moon is um controlling our we're kind of responsible for our emotions in a sense that's where cancer pisces and scorpio they represent the moon energies okay and of emotions 
So magical blessings, whatever you're going through, you're being assisted by a magical fairy blessings. The fairies say you can bless others too. So something's coming into balance for you, Gemini, or fruition, a blessing, uh, um, wish fulfillment. It could be a relationship or either money involved with these magical blessings. You're finding in balance. Some of you are balancing out your finances and you're balancing out your love life right now. And then that there are magical blessings. Okay. Um, and you're going to be able to, whatever you, whatever you do, I don't, if you're in a relationship or a new partnership, I'm not talking to the single people. Okay. But whoever I'm talking to in the high vibration that is in a relationship, you guys are going to have a breakthrough in that relationship if you're having struggles and challenges and finances right now. You have the angels and the fairies on your side and the ancestors of the Holy Spirit is with you. And so whatever you're going through right now, if it's a hard time, you're being assisted by the magical fairies, okay? So you're going to find balance in this relationship and there's going to be some type of breakthrough. For others of finances, and this is for everybody that is on the high vibrational um, frequency, you are finding balance in your income right now. It probably was in balance the last couple of, I don't know, a couple months, maybe weeks, um, maybe last year for some of you guys. And you guys are getting ready. Some of you coming out of that hardship of finances and finding balance in that. And then for others of you, what I've been feeling these other couple of readings, there is a huge magical blessing that is about to pop. Bust you upside your damn head, and you're gonna find balance in your relation. I mean, in your oh, oh, okay. Wait, hold on. Let me finish that up. For some of y'all, yeah, the for the it's gonna pop you upside your head, and you're gonna be able to find balance in your finances. Okay, this is gonna be some type of generational wealth. This is not. I'm not talking about no hundreds or thousands of dollars. I'm talking about some big ass coin pop. Okay, a magical blessing, something from the universe, a gift for you. Uh, finding balance and cutting out people, places, and things that no longer serve your highest good. You're actually learning the magic, how to balance out your, your self-mastering your emotions, Gemini. That is how you actually create. You have a lot of heart chakra energy going on right now, so you're opening yourself up to love and to let go, okay, and to accept things for what they are, not resisting divine, not resisting the state of whatever's going on in your energy or your life. You're just finding balance between those things. You're finding balance between your work, your rest, and your playtime and everything else in your life, Gemini. And you guys are coming into balance and harmony. And for others of y'all, y'all about to find a soulmate, balance out your finances and your money through a particular soulmate that's coming into your energy I'm picking up as well. Okay, this is a well-off soulmate, wealthy. Um, you guys have the same mindset. Um, some of you are, are this wealthy. Um soulmate and then some of you you're going to run into this wealthy soulmate okay but spirit is this is all divine timing because you're being assisted by the magical fairy blessings right now okay so i'm picking up in this also this relationship it is you guys have a mission together who whatever this mission is you guys are going to be blessing others around you this you guys are going to be an example to other people okay you're going to give people hope okay who's lost and found Lost and found, what was lo once lost is about to be found, thanks to the lost and found fairy. Sometimes fairies, excuse me, sometimes she can help us find things we never even realized were lost. Exactly. So at the end of the day, you guys are finding yourselves. You're finding that balance, okay? And you're receiving these magical blessings or getting ready to receive these magical blessings over these next couple of days on this new moon. Fool, I keep saying new moon. Because you did, you set your intentions in the new moon cycle. That's what that is. You set your intentions, okay? And now it's coming into fruition. The balance is coming. It's coming. Everything's coming into balance. Life is coming into balance. Yeah, you're about to receive some wonderful, magical blessing, whether it be monetary and love, physical and spiritual, okay? Yep, you are. Here we go. Whatever's going on, you're going to celebrate good times. Come on. Okay, y'all about to celebrate some shit. You thought you lost it, but as soon as you thought you lost or you lost hope or whatever the case may be, it's like it's like, it's like when you least expected it, it just hits you like a ton of bricks. And now you're going to be able to celebrate whatever was lost. You Now you're going to find it, which is love and finances, spiritual blessings, okay? Um, some of you are going to receive an exchange or an uh, ascension. Okay, that's a magical blessing. 
you're going to find balance between that and you're going to be celebrating. Whatever it is, you're going to be celebrating. Get ready to let your hair down and celebrate. It's time to go out and dance and play. An invitation could be on the way. So you guys are going to get invited, invited, <laughs> invited to a party. Some of y'all about to go turn up this week, weekend, this week too. You guys are going to receive some good news. Whatever this magical blessing is you, that you thought you lost or... It was taking so a long time to get here, whatever the case may be. Child, y'all about to celebrate, okay, because you're healed now. Yeah, whatever you wished for, you wished for. It was a while. Oh, so this is a wish. This magical blessing that's about to hit is a wish. Oh, yes, I love it. Use your wishes wisely to manifest your heart's desire and take practical steps towards making your dreams come true. So your wishes are coming true on this new moon or the next moon or, or the next full moon cycle. If it's not this full moon, it's the next full moon, okay? You guys are almost there. Find that balance. For those of that's not that's not happening for on this new moon, I mean, full, I keep saying new moon. Because it's something that you did on the new moon that you brought all this shit into fruition. Okay, damn, Gemini. Look at you, mis magicians and shit. Really working. I mean, this is what this channel do for y'all, okay? For real, 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 real. Like, all you got to do is put in the work and find some balance, okay, to receive these magical blessings and to celebrate. Use your wishes wisely. Thoughts are things. Your words are energy, okay? Your mind and thoughts are energy. Use those motherfuckers wisely, okay? And you guys are healing, as you should, okay? Now is the time for you to give or receive healing. Everyone has a natural ability to heal others. Yes, even you, so a lot of you are master healers, okay? Very nurturing, loving, healing, balanced, temperance, earth angels, okay? Um, some of you thought that I'm getting from this energy lost and found and then healing. Some of you have found healing. That's what you found. You thought you lost it through some... I don't know how you lost it, Gemini. You became in balance some kind of way. Maybe you lost it through a Libra <laughs> with the scales and the balance. Some of you guys are going to come into a Gemini is going to come into balance with a Libra, okay? Or somebody, or a Gemini, you're wishing for a Libra so you could heal something with this person, okay? Precious time, yeah. Be mindful. Okay, I feel okay. Thank you, Spirit. High vibe, you're right. You're all right. You're doing the damn thing. You find in balance, okay? You're getting ready to celebrate. Your wishes are about to come to fruition. Whatever you wished for, whatever you worked on, this new moon cycle to come into fruition, this full moon cycle, it's, it's getting ready to happen. You're going to be celebrating. And congratulations to you ahead of time. For the lower vibes, okay, because I'm picking up, because I'm like, wait, there's a there's a Gemini with this fine balance, or I mean, not a Gemini, a Libra. A Libra's involved somewhere with these magical blessings, and the magical blessings with the um, Gemini, you being the magician, this, this, uh, so either a Libra is trying to balance something out with you because they've lost you or you lower vibration Gemini have lost a high vibrational Gemini that you want to celebrate with. Okay. You want to find some balance with this Libra or, or reverse the roles as they need be. It doesn't have to be a Gemini and a Libra. This is what I'm picking up. So I'm picking up specific energies in this particular reading. It can, it can resonate with anybody or anybody or nobody. Okay. So just, you know, you know the do. Somebody want to come celebrate with somebody, okay? And they're wishing for you, Gemini. And they saying wish wisely, or Gemini, you wishing for them, okay? To make your dreams come true is now is the time to heal, okay? Um, but uh, maybe somebody wasted somebody's time because it's saying precious time. The fairy of time wants you to experience every moment fully and to make the most of your precious time. Be mindful not to waste others' time. So either a Libra or a Gemini, y'all take the roles, Whoever is of the lower vibration have wasted someone's time. And now they want to come back and heal something because either you, Gemini, my babies, are receiving these magical blessings or this high vibrational Libra is receiving magical blessings and they found balance in their life. And now they want to come celebrate with this person. Okay, they wishing for you, high vibe, whoever you are. You can be any damn sign. You don't have to be, like I said, a Gemini or a Libra. But, um... Definitely, you, the Queen of Cups is involved somewhere with this healing card. You know, I'm just, I'm just telling you how I'm feeling, okay? It doesn't say Queen of Cups, but this is the energy I'm getting from this healing card. Some of you guys could be a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, okay? 
Um, somebody wished for a Queen of Cups to heal something with the Queen of Cups, honey, and they wasted somebody's time. So, Gemini, you could be this Queen of Cups, okay? This loving, mothering, loving, healing, nurturing energy, okay? You heal this person. This, they, this person lost you, and now they want to come find you, but this person wasted your time at the end of the day, okay? Now somebody wishing for somebody. Whoever this low vibrational, crusty energy is, they are wishing for you because you're in celebration mode, or they will be uh, wanting to celebrate with you reaching out yeah they want to come to calmer waters to you gemini high vibe yep and reconcile and celebrate good times come on <laughs> the tower oh no did you complete a cycle gemini oh high vibe yes you did you did you healed yourself okay so now this is why this person's wishing mm -mm, mm -mm. yeah you and look at you gemini high vibe whoever you are babies look at you all wish fulfillment, you sexy, single, abundant, you all juicy fruit knit off the tree, picking fruit. Some of y'all going picking fresh fruits out of your gardens in the backyard, front yard, wherever you are. Yes, you are. Some of y'all realize that when you went outside, some insects ate up your plants or fruit trees or whatever the case may be. And then others of you, you healed yourself. You, yes, absolutely. And you moved to Karma Waters to get celebrated. And now this person's wishing for you all in their head, trying to go back inside themselves and reflect on the inside of what mistakes that they made, how they kept you in a third party situation. They're in deep regret now, okay, because they couldn't cut you out. They was confused. This person was confused about you, okay? Or either if they wanted to get into a higher level of commitment with you or either if they wanted to have kids with you. But this is somebody who you did um, nurture. You were very mothering with the Nine of Pentacles energy. You're very fulfilling, very wish fulfillment. I'm getting wish fulfillment with this Nine of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups at the end of the day. And then the Empress showed up. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, because this person, oh, yeah, you moved to Carmel Waters, Gemini. You left. So you said, I'm not going to be blinded no more by this shit. This motherfucker wasted my time. Oh, yeah, and that's when you went over away to the Six of Cups because, uh, child, you was like, he got me fucked up or she got me fucked up. Thinking, I'm, yeah, they, this person doesn't make rational decisions. They're all up in their head. They they live they live on uh, Mars or Venus somewhere. Not, not Venus, Mars or Pluto. Mm -hmm. And now they can't sleep. They're stressed out. They have anxiety, nightmares, embarrassed. And I don't even know about embarrassed. I don't want to get too, yeah. They're, they're just pretty much upset that they were undecided about you, that they didn't see that you were actually the empress, that you were the one to get the ball rolling. You were actually the wish fulfillment. You were the magical blessing, okay? But now that you found balance in yourself because this person, look, you done transformed. You done transformed, okay? You done transformed. You done showed up, showed out. You manifested your best life. Now this person is feeling a little sour because... They manipulated you in a third-party situation and cut you out and moved to calmer waters. All in an illusion. All for something that's fake with this page of cups. And they want to make some type of apology to you and tell you how they love you. But it's all hot air. Yeah, it's hot air. So, you know what? Don't second-guess yourself if you close out a cycle with this person. Yeah. You have the earth. The earth God did this, okay? With the world card and this healing card. Literally, and then you ended up in the Nine of Pentacles, and that was the tower, because whatever this person did caused a fucking tower to you, Gemini. Yeah, because they invested in a whole nother lover, and you showed up and showed out again. Yeah, they, they invested in a whole nother lover, and then they caused a, he caused a heavy burden to themselves. Everything went downhill ever since they went over to this third-party situation, okay? What else, Holy Spirit? What else? What else? Oh, dang. Yeah, the cycle's closed, but it's too late. It's too... Yeah, they all in their head. Child, no. All this is after the fact. This is... A, look, I'm in the card with this. This is the nine of wands. You're guarded and defensive. You've been through a lot. You found your balance, okay? This person pretty much devastated you. And I'm picking that up. They did. Because you're so against this person. Let me see. Hold on. Now they want to put in the teamwork. Yeah, they can't. The cycle's closed and for them putting in teamwork and collaboration. Now they're feeling defeated all because you got your back turned towards them. But now they, because they were being toxic. Now they want to release this toxicity. It's just toxicity. 
They want to release the evilness and the, the, the devil. They want to release the devil because you're manifesting. You're manifesting money. You're manifesting wealth. You're manifesting businesses. You're manifesting um, solid, something solid. And you don't want this person back. Be yeah, because they're a liar. They're a con man. They're a liar. They are honest. They are nothing. And they want to communicate with you. The spirit said the liar wants to communicate with you because they're stuck. And if you communicate with them... They're going to keep you stuck. Because all this is is what they want. Look out. Look at this man. Look at this man. How him looking. Whether it be a male or a female. Shit. They want to have some, some sex. Because they little. They honey. They, they they stuck. They cannot move forward. Yeah. because Ever since you walked away. So this is part of their karma. Yeah. So now they've been in conflict and chaos ever since you left. Like I said. Ever since you left. This person's been in conflict and chaos. Yes. While you've been getting new beginnings. <laughs> While you've been getting new beginnings and stuff, okay, hot ideas, whatever you touch is turning to gold because you're the king of pentacles, queen of pentacles, you're in your masculine energy at this point. Yeah, and this person is heartbroken because the wheel has turned in your favor. Yes, and now they're feeling foolish or they because they took a leap of faith or a risk somewhere else. Now they're drinking, feeling dumb. You could be dealing with the Aries energy. Um... You could be dealing with an earth sign or a fire sign. It could be any any sign. Yeah. So anyway, what is the final? What's, what's, what's going on so I can end this? What's going on, spirit? The temperance angels here. Yeah, balance is being restored right now with the will of fortune and the temperance angel. Yeah, so you're you're to get this. Whoever I'm I told you, because you walked away or whatever move you made or whatever you did, you know it, though. You know it. You know that you're about to get this payout, this Ten of Pentacles energy, okay? This is where this magical blessing comes in. This is where now you're, so some of y'all are Queen of Pentacles right now. So some of you are the Queen of Pentacles right now. You're manifest, okay, you're working with the moon magic for sure. But the Queen of Wands energy, this tower is getting ready to happen, okay? With this magical blessings, yes, definitely, okay? You are, whatever you, if you're in a good place, you're about to be in a better place. And if you're in a bad place, you're going to be in a good place if you're high vibrational. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you know it. You know it. You know it. You know it. So you're blocking out anything negative. You're focused on what... Yeah, you're literally, as I'm speaking, you are currently and actively manifesting. Okay? So congratulations to whatever you're doing, whatever you're manifesting. It's the Ten of Pentacles. It's putting you up to the King of Pentacles energy. Okay? And if it's not this moon cycle, you guys need to find some balance and start on the next moon cycle, okay? Because whatever, yeah, lost and found. So what, because, yeah. So maybe if it's this video, you need to find a kind of, kind of strengthen your little, not your little, because you're none of your little. You're actually huge. You're a big deal. But um, you need to balance out your energy. Focus a little bit more on what you're wanting. Okay, with this King of Wands energy, because he's a master manifester. Okay, so you do whoever is searching for you, the Gemini, and want to come together, or this Libra, or whoever, or this Earth sign, or whatever. They are a counterpart. They really are, but they are a karmic. Yes, they are. They wishing for you too, child. They trying to. And this person might have gone through a little transition or whatever. But what does should Gemini do? Should you not give this energy that want them back? Mm. Walk away, Gemini, because they backstabbed and oh, sure. Walk away, Gemini, because they backstabbed and betrayed you, and they kept you with an illusion. So I mean, yeah. Hold on, yeah. They wanted to keep you trapped up, but even though it is a soulmate, but y'all for so, I'm just saying, for y'all that are manifesting this big, gling, 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 gling. This person, whoever this devil energy is, they cannot go with you. That's all I can say, okay? They are trapped by the devil, okay? They are trapped by the devil. They made a contract with the devil, okay? This person is in an illusion and they are confused. So they're an illusion that you are there to a cuss, but this person is, um, he don't make no money. They, they bored where they at. They don't have a lot of money. They lose the money. They fit financially imbalanced. All of that is not heavenly wealth. Okay, this person is not, mm -mm, you don't want to tap into that energy. So this person is broke. Yes, we're supposed to help the help the homeless, but not have relationships with them. You know what I mean? Help the homeless, but don't have relationships with them. My God. Tell me, oh, yeah, no. Mm -mm, mm -mm. 
like I said, this person cannot come with you, Gemini. This is this is your celebration. This is you, boo. Because you did the work and you you put in you put in the work and you found the balance. So this is why you are able to receive and you will receive these magical blessings, okay? Yep. Okay, Gemini, I like that. Okay, babies, that's been your reading. Until next time, I love you so much and congratulations on your magical blessings. If you don't see anything for Rishin this new full moon, try again, okay? Find that balance, okay? Uh, go in a little harder. All right, babies, I love you. Bye.